And joining us now, the pride of Long Beach Poly High School, Deshaun Jackson here on SportsCenter. Hey, man, appreciate the time. L let me ask you about this decision first. Was it more about going to Tampa Bay, Deshaun, or was it more about leaving Washington? Um, I, I think it was more about going to Tampa Bay. Um, you know, I, I not once in my mind thought anything about leaving Washington or, or trying to make a statement for that. I just wanted to, you know, move forward in my career and, you know, find a place that best fit myself. And I think, you know, here in uh, Tampa Bay, they have a lot of upsides, a lot of, you know, camaraderie in their team they built last year that, you know, to add addition, like a Deshaun Jackson would be great. And I, I love it just as well. <laughs> all right, but, all right, but you know why I'm asking that question, Deshaun, because there's a lot of drama surrounding Washington lately, front office especially. Right. What's your take on your former team? Ah. Uh, it's really not a focus of mine no more. I guess I can say uh, whatever they have going on, on out there, you know, I wish them the best. But, you know, my talents have brought me down to, to Tampa. So, uh, you know, I'm focused on, you know, the future, being able to come get an opportunity to play with a, a guy like Jameis Winston, Mike Evans. I think that duel is going to be crazy. You know? I'm just looking forward to the opportunity to go out there and start. Was that the reason that you chose the Bucks? Because you had your pick at, at quite a few teams, reportedly. What made you think that the, the Bucks were going to be the best fit for you over the next three years? Well, I, I think the, the, the best fit was the Bucks. Um, you know, they was actually last year, it was intriguing because I can remember playing in Washington, looking back and forth. You know, uh, us and them was kind of battling for that spot to, to make it to the playoffs. You know, we would lose a the game, they would win the game. So just seeing what they built last year and, you know, over the years to, to be able to commit to win to win um, was intriguing to me. And I, I wanted to be here to be in a team that's young, that has a lot of upside. And, you know, Coach Cutter was here and, uh, you know, watching him at Arizona State when I was at Cal, um, you know, it just all made sense for me. They are young. They are talented. Yeah. What kind of effect do you think Mike Evans is going to have on your production? Uh, Mike Evans, I mean, Mike, <laughs> Mike Evans, I, I think, you know, he's one of the, the, the better uh, receivers in the NFL. You know, he's a 6'5 guy. He's fast. Uh, he's agile. And, uh, you know, to have a guy like me on the other side, just, you know, a speedy, fast receiver, big plays, you know, adding us two together with the Jameis Winston, I mean, you know, I really think sky's the limit. So, you know, we still have a lot of work to put in. Um, you know, I'm here to, to be an older veteran guy to help out and uh, really just bring the mentality of winning. You know, I want to come in and win. That's really all that matters. You're about to enter your 10th season in the NFL, third team, um, Philadelphia, Washington, now Tampa Bay. Of course, you grew up in Long Beach. You went to college at Cal. I know a lot of your peeps right. back west are going to wonder, are you ever going to play on the West Coast? What's up with this, man? <laughs> oh, man, I, I don't think the West Coast is in the calling for me, man. I, I won't be playing on the West Coast. Uh, I'm really not really worried, you know, about playing home. Uh, I think, you know, the best fit is right here where I'm at right now. Um, it's a lot of distractions home, obviously. You know, everybody and their mama will be wanting to come to the game. So I think they'll have to travel a little farther to come out here. But, I mean, it's Florida, man. It's great weather, great beaches. I mean, how, how can you beat that? <laughs> That's true. Uh, off the field, though, something I want to ask you about as well, Deshaun. You're one of the producers for the upcoming Tupac biopic, All Eyes on Me. Elle and I actually saw a trailer for it the other night. It looks phenomenal. Yeah. And the actor playing Pac looks just like him. Creepy. How did yes. you get involved? <laughs> Well, actually, my business partner, L.T. Hutton, um, you know, he's been having that movie under his belt for, you know, 10-plus years. And, uh, you know, everybody was always like, man, is he ever going to produce his movie? Is it ever going to come out? But, uh, you know, as, as far as, you know, the TV and the movie world, sometimes it's, it's a lot to get clearances. And Tupac is one of them, you know, deals where it was, it, he had to go through a lot to get it clear. But, you know, me and L.T. have been partners for, you know, going on eight-plus years. And, uh, you know, to have the opportunity to be a, a co-producer and, uh, you know, go throughout the works of that movie. I mean, I think it's going to be one of the greatest movies to ever come out. So, you know, I'm very excited about that opportunity and uh, really just, you know, setting myself up for business and things off the field is, you know, something that, you know, I'm into as well. So I'm very excited. Everybody check it out June 16th. You know, all eyes on me will be coming out. But wait a minute, though, because Pac's from the Bay, right? You're from Long Beach, <laughs> as Eves has said a million right. times. Well, what was it about his right. story that resonated with you? Why you didn't do Snoop? Well, I didn't do Snoop. Uh, <laughs> I mean, uh, man, Snoop one day will probably have something coming out, man. Uh, me and Snoop do does have a great relationship, and, uh, you know, he does a lot of uh, great things in the community with the kids and, you know, Pop Warner football. But, you know, I think it was important for the Tupac, uh, Tupac movie to really come out first and to really just really press that issue first because uh, Tupac was one of the greatest ever, and he's, you know, one of my biggest artists to ever do it. All right, what's your, what's your favorite Pac track? Yep. Oh, come on. All eyes on me, man. All right. All right. So you're going for the movie title. I understand the promotion. He's going for the movie hey, title. It's, nah, it's so that, I mean, all eyes on me. Mine's you know, I, I get around. Like... <laughs> I like I get around. Picture me rolling I mean... in the bins that isn't stolen. See, that's L. <laughs> Definitely. All right, man. Appreciate the time as always. Uh, good luck down there in Florida.
All right, thank you.